we're gonna make some porridge. No idea, all right? A lot of people don't know if make Jamaican planting porridge, so. I have my own recipe, which I'm gonna share with you, all right? And this recipe will be totally different from every other else kind of recipe which Chef God and I'm gonna do. So, yeah, I'm gonna show you how to do this one. Some real authentic um, Jamaican planting porridge. So, we're gonna show you how to make it. And it's not gonna complicate it, all right? In the meantime, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Leave your comments to that friend, and a friend to that friend. So what we're gonna do, cut off this bit, and this bit, run the knife across, and remove the skin, like this. All right? All right, guys, look how we are done. I shouldn't be showing how I go out with it. All right, it's so simple. Yeah, very, very it's, it's simple, but you know, a lot of people don't know. Cut it up like this. You see? And then I'm gonna put it into the blender like this. Simple. I use our gloves because sometimes everything I kind of look a bit steely. So I use our gloves and remove it. Alright? Then what we're gonna do. I'm show them a pack of oats. I'm gonna put some oats in it, but now I make too much planting. We're gonna put roughly about a teaspoon, a tablespoon of oats into the blender so you can put whatever you like. All right, one tablespoon of oats. All right, inside of it. I'm using some organic oats which is much more healthier and much better all right so once you do that then we're gonna put some natural spring water into it like this lovely all right then after you do that then you want to get your blender sharon what's going on put on the blender like this and then we're gonna make some nice like this. Lovely. So once you do that. It to look like this, all right? Yeah, yeah, man. So now we're gonna show you how to make the porridge. Now we're gonna come over here, sir, with the pot. It's the delicious. We're gonna need them size pot. Get the cooker on. You see, him to medium size pot, and this is a requested video from one of my audience. Oh, I said, Chef Ricardo, you need for sure so to make the porridge again. And I say, you know what? You don't have to worry yourself. We got a lot of recipes. So we're going to show you um, from scratch to finish. All right? Excellent, Chef Ricardo. Let's get some of the magic ingredients. All right? So if you're just a wake up, welcome to Chef Ricardo Cooking Show. We're going to show you how to make this beautiful Jamaican porridge, all right? Yeah, so medium size Dutchy on the cooker. And then we're going to pour some hot water. We're going to use hot water very quicker and faster. Two cups of hot water in the pot. We may have to have some more as it goes on, but that's fine, all right? And what we're gonna do, we got some milk powder. We're gonna use Jamaican milk powder. 
coconut milk powder. Here it is, coconut milk powder we're gonna use. And we're going to show you exactly how to do it. So we're gonna go into it with a large tablespoon of the coconut milk powder. Verdict, and big up yourself. What's going on? Good afternoon. And put that into the water. All right. So we're using some coconut milk powder. Let's put a little bit more. All right, into the water like that. That's the coconut milk powder we're using. A little bit more healthier and more better. All right. So once you do that, then we're gonna get some of our secret to put inside of it. We're gonna get some um, fermento seed. This is fermento seed. Jamaican fermento seed. We need to put that inside of it. As a lot of people are make these things, but they're not doing them the right way because they're not spend time and do it the right way. So we are showing you how you can do it in another way at home. All right? Yeah, I am good. Oh, it was in the hospital. When you're in the hospital, man, you must call your second doctor, you know, Chef Ricardo. Me give you some natural home stuff where you can do at home. So if you um if you're in the hospital, you make sure you call Chef Ricardo and let Chef Ricardo know exactly what's going on. Hopefully you'll get better. We will. We I mean, we don't have to give you any remedy you now because we have Father God who can take care of you. All right. We pray for you and we'll ask the Lord to bless you and guide you and protect you. So any one of my subscribers and followers. Oh, yeah, I was Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that, man. Well, okay, we pray for you, man. We pray that the Lord will recover you as soon as possible. You know? Yeah. And that's why um, sometimes it is good for you guys. Some of these kind of in, um, recipe which I share with you, like, um, you might see I did um, cayenne pepper on a regular basic. Because cayenne pepper presents strokes. Cayenne pepper is very good. Cayenne pepper olive oil and lemon juice is very good but otherwise we pray for you and pray that the lord will cover you as soon as possible all right yeah yeah it's good. any one of you guys are going through anything man just get in touch with chef ricardo we're gonna put some cloves into the water all right we're gonna put a little bit of cloves into the water a few cloves yeah but we pray that the lord will cover you very soon very very soon all right, we know that the Lord can do that, man. All right, guys. So, one of my subscribers, make sure you guys pray for her, man. All right? You know what I mean? Because we have people who pray and believe in the Father God who create this world and create human being. I know that God can heal our body and our mind and our soul and our heart. So, pray for my subscriber. Wherever you are, wherever you are at the moment, make sure you have her in your prayer and pray. All right? And that's why I love my YouTube channel, you know what I mean? Because sometimes it is good to hear what other people are going through and we can also pray for them. Don't be selfish. Pray for one another and pray that the Lord will bless each and every one of us every single day. Day upon top of day. All right? Don't be jealous. Don't be bad mind. Don't be embolous. And pray for one another. All right? Because we don't know what the next day will bring for anyone in this world. All right? We still have the porridge and we still have talk and we still have tell you exactly what's going on. All right? So you can see the liquid is boiling up. So what we're going to do, we're going to pour that um, ingredients, which we just blend up into it like this. Lovely. And then we're going to mix it like this. All right? Yeah. Mix it up just like this. It's going to be cooking. You know, the reason why you want to mix it like this, you want to make sure it does not um, lump. There's no lump. So that's why I say I'm doing it that way. I might put some water into this to rinse it out. Rinsing out my blender with some hot water. Pour that inside of it. Lovely. <clears throat> All right. Just keep mixing it up like this. 
Lovely. All right. So as I can see, nice one. It is mixing up properly. Let's keep mixing it like this, guys. And if it's too thick, we'll show you how to correct it. Lovely. Look at that. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna add some more hot water to it, guys, add it a bit thick. Rough about, you know what I mean? Yeah, a little bit more hot water. Keep stirring it. And keep stirring it, stir it and stir it. You see that? Look at that. Keep stir it. Yeah, and keep stirring it. So it's still thick. So you want to add a little bit more hot water. Not much. Just keep... You can use milk. But, you know what I mean? I'm allergic to the milk. So I have to be careful with milk. Wicked. Look at that. Nice. So you just keep stirring it. I'm just using water. Hot water. I boil my kettle. So that is perfect. We're not going to get it anymore. Um, we're just going to keep it like this. This is perfect. Right. Lovely. That is nice. All right, so we're gonna make that cook for a few minutes. All right, guys? Yeah. We're gonna make that cook and look at that. That looking lovely, isn't it? You see that? Excellent, guys. You see that? Look how that look nice. So that's what all you want to see the porridge look like. So we're going to make that cook for a nice good 10, 15 minutes. Turn on your cooker a little bit. All right. Yes, remember to pray for my subscribers. You know what I mean? Just went through a little bit of time, but yeah, best porridge in the world. Definitely. Big up yourself, D. Yeah, man. One of the world best Jamaican. Please share the video. Please tell a friend. And a friend, tell a friend. And subscribe to the YouTube channel. Yeah. But as you guys can see, Nicole, good morning, chef. Everyone, have a blessed weekend. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you so much. Yeah. Yeah, Monday is bank holiday in the UK. So wherever you're there in the UK, big up yourself if you're there abroad or a yard or Jamaica, wherever you are in the world. Big up on yourself. Look after your health. Chef Ricardo is doing a five-day liver cleanse with cayenne pepper and olive oil and lemon juice. And as I said before, cayenne pepper, you can do your own research on cayenne pepper. It's a very good source which can also help you to um, present strokes and heart attack. Very, very good. Cayenne pepper. I did this video all the time. But a lot of people laugh after me when I do those kind of videos. They say this guy is a crazy person. But, you know what I mean? I do it because I do my research. All right. Yeah. So, um, Brown, what's going on? Big up yourself. Thank you so much. Yeah. Um, yes, I just had on it. What is this? This is um, some planting porridge with some coconut milk and some spices. Yeah, good vibes. Something different, you know what I mean? Yeah, something different on the weekend. As you guys can see, real authentic Jamaican porridge. Lots of spice and thing, you know what I mean? Yeah. That is good, man. Yeah. Look at that. Excellent. That is beautiful, guys. And it's simple and very delicious. Oh, KC code. 
Thank you so much. Thank you so much for sharing. Big up yourself. Look at that. Excellent. Beautiful. You know what I mean? So if you're at home right now and you feel like you want to make some Jamaican planting porridge or cornmeal or banana porridge, um, this is a recipe where you can use at home. Beautiful, simple, and delicious. Um, it is green planting with some coconut milk powder and some spices we're gonna put inside of it we're gonna put some put some cloves in it no it's not cornmeal because it looks like cornmeal it's green planting no. chris big up yourself thank you so much nicole thank you so much yeah it's something different oh sorry i thought it was cornmeal because i came on late that's all right man it is planting porridge Follow me on Instagram if you guys need the recipes, you know. All right? You can give it a recipe on my Instagram page. Chef Ricardo Cooking. All right, look at that. I just open up the pot now, man. I will cover the pot. Let's so you guys can see what I'm doing. cover this and make it go and cook for a few minutes all right so we'll cover that all right so right here I, if you notice i have a cup right here all right i want to show you something where you guys can do at home so before you eat your meal it is very important to do this but a lot of people doesn't know these things all right you can use lemon or you can use apple cider vinegar so we're gonna put a pinch of apple cider vinegar into the cup just like this just a little pinch not too much all right so that's the apple cider vinegar I put inside of it okay this is very important for every one of you guys who are watching chef ricardo so if you're at home and you are cooking rice or pasta or anything, I want to encourage you to do this. All right? Yeah. Then what you want to do, you can put some hot water, um, lukewarm water into the cup like this. All right? Rough about half cups of water. I'm using, I just catch it on the pot cover that you guys can see. Right. So, if you're at home right now and you sit down in your set here, or you're on your phone, or you're on your device, or you're on the TV, whatever you guys are doing, this is a very important message for you today. Do this at home, guys. It can present from sugar, diabetic, and a lot more stuff. All right. Then what you're gonna do? Just tap it up with some cold water from your from your So that is some cold water from my buckle. You don't need to do nothing else. You can put some lemon in it. Or you can use the apple cider vinegar on this one. Do not put anything else in it. Don't put no sugar or no sweetener or no honey. And then what you want to do, all right? This is what you want to do before you eat any kind of food at home. Is this. Very important. Now we're going to drink this. So what this do, thank you so much for that super chat. Wow, thank you so much. Um, my, um, my drink, uh, I need to find, I'm going to pull it up. Don't worry yourself. Thank you so much. So before you do anything, before you eat your dinner or your breakfast or anything, this one is a very, very good one. So this one going to present you from having sugar 
and present it from build up in a cholesterol level. All right. Apple cider vinegar and a little bit of lukewarm water or cold water. And, and I, you're good to go. Mm. So you see, I'm drinking it. All right. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. And you can use lemon also. All right. If you have lemon. What is the ingredients? Apple cider vinegar. Lukewarm water. Or you can use a little bit of cold water in it. All right. Spring water. Or you drink a cup of water before you eat your meal. Very important one that. Take Chef Ricardo advice. All right, let's look at the porridge. Nice one. So as you can see, that's the porridge. All right, that can present you from building up um, a high sugar level, help to slow down your cholesterol level in your immune system. All right, and that's the most important thing. You can eat your food, but you need to have something to control the cholesterol level and cut on your sugar level all right guys it is important all right now let's go and show you guys how to sweeten the porridge okay we're gonna show you how to sweeten it and put in some spice inside of it and it's gonna be super easy and simple so first of all we're gonna put our secret medication in it this is some vanilla jamaican vanilla roughly about a teaspoon and give it a mix just like this all right look at that nice all right lovely color lovely flavor lovely texture as you guys can see for yourself that looks delicious okay now i'm gonna go into the medical box we're gonna get some grounded not the egg here it is, not the egg. That's a pinch of not the egg inside of it, all right? And then you wanna whisk it out, you know what I mean? Yeah, wicked, nice. All right. Um, grown it cinnamon powder. We're gonna put a pinch. Last one. good yeah so that look nice um mixed spice we're gonna put some mixed spice yeah mix it out inside of it not looking good yeah yeah man that looking nice so we got mixed spice, cinnamon, and grounded nut and egg. I'm gonna put um, some sea salt. All right. Um, what kind of what? Oh, that kind of cream. What kind of liquid are you? you? Liquid. This is some Jamaican. Um, green planting porridge. All right, this is porridge. You know what I mean? You know, in Jamaica, we grew up on this kind of food, you know. You know what I mean? Planting porridge and oats porridge. So it's planting and some oats mixed together. Let's get some. Uh, Sweet condensed milk, or you can also use um, honey. So we just put in some sweet condensed milk. 
just to, a tablespoon just to make it turn to, to another color like a rich color so you can use whatever you like honey or uh, most people use brown sugar and but you know what I mean some people use sweet condensed milk so I'll just put in another tablespoon inside of it all right give it a mix and then you're good to go because you don't want, remember you know, these things already have sugar in them so you don't want to put too much sweetness inside of it you want to just keep it just to give it a little rich color lovely that looking good Simple. All right, you just wanna taste it. All right, and see. To be honest with you, I think it'll just take a little pinch more sea salt. All right. A little bit more sweet condensed milk. So you want to sweeten and taste as it goes on to your flavor where you like it. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Good morning, Chef Ricardo. Good morning. Alright. That looking good. No. That's it. So you can sweeten and taste as it goes on. might have said to yourself oh i need this in it i need that in it and, uh, you know so sweeten wow can i yes queen what's going on queen up big up yourself yeah man i can anytime david carbian big up yourself thank you so much so you can sweeten and goes on as you like you can add whatever you like to it you can put in your flavor you know what i mean russian big up yourself um every one of you guys who are watching big up on yourself right yeah so but it's just a simple recipe it's a requested video if you want to request something from me feel free you know what i mean <laughs> you're hungry well you have to, you have to go into the kitchen and go into the kitchen and, and just wrap up something quickly and you know what i mean get yourself uh, some food but as you guys can see for yourself i just met this because someone has requested back the video from me that they love our mate, the Jamaican porridge. All right. So, and I said, yes, I can do it. You know what I mean? I'm always making porridge. So I go to London and I buy the plantain. And I say, yes, let's do this today. Yeah. <clears throat> so, whatever you guys are doing today, man, you can do this one. Win some, big up yourself. Thank you so much. If you guys want the recipe, I will put the recipe in the description box or you can also follow me. You can use um, green banana if you like to. All right. Edwards, big up yourself. Win some port more. Only in a wikini. Rochelle, Margaret, Felicia, and Angela. Life of the Anna Fear. Big up, <laughs> big up yourself every time. I like that one, man. All right, 
Um, so you say you're requesting a, a request that I am um, okay, you're requesting a banana rub. Okay, all right, definitely. I'm gonna work on that recipe for you. Yeah, fried dumpling. Oh, I got a lot of recipe and fried dumpling. I have one coming out soon, too. All right, so you guys can see what's going on right here. Yeah, man, look at that. That's proper Jamaican porridge. Let's share it up. Show them. We're gonna um, shear it up for you guys. Let's put this right here and then, yeah. Let's shear up this beautiful Jamaican porridge for you guys today because. You know what I mean? I like, enough of you guys have not seen me do this for a long time, you know, so it's good to come into the kitchen and fresh, refresh on the mind, you know? That means you know, guys can be happy. Yeah. Oh, to make Camille Parja see your life. Okay, wicked. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. If you miss the video, the video will always be there, guys. All right? Yeah, man. Don't go anywhere. The video will be always there. So if you missed the video, don't feel any way. Alright. Yeah, a good vibe. Alright, now. So let's move this and let's put this right here. So we're gonna show now how oh, my grandmother would do this at home. So my grandmother would do this at home and just pour it out and give her guys with all bread and all them things there. My grandmother did the ramp in the kitchen now. So this is what she would be doing. Pour it out like this. Alright. A nice bowl of porridge. I'll call the grandkids them. I say, come on, have a dinner and a breakfast. Put some crackers in it. Uh, some people put bread inside of it. Look at that, guys. You can put fruits. You can put anything you like inside of it. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel. And you do not miss none of my video. And, you know what I mean? Please like and share the video, guys. It is important that you guys can see exactly what Chef Rick going to be making in the kitchen. The full video is on my YouTube channel right now. Okay? Um, I'm saving the video on my YouTube channel as you guys can watch it. And I'm, I'm not going to delete the video. I'm going to keep the video right there as you guys can watch it. All right? So the most important thing, follow me and you can also learn a lot more recipe from Chef Ricardo. All right? Um, I got the video which I want to make. Um, the vegan ice cream. I'm going to try and make that one probably later on or tomorrow. Vegan ice cream, guys. Something different. For all of the person who are suffering from high sugar level and want to enjoy a certain lifestyle, we got a recipe for you coming. Yeah. Now, if you like the video, leave your comments. Tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. And please subscribe to the YouTube channel, guys. You won't miss anything. Trust me. I did all different kind of recipes. I did healthy lifestyle, weight loss, detoxing, cleansing the body, cleansing the liver. All of these things are there for you. It's just you have to set Chef Ricardo. Send me the recipe and I will, if you follow me on my social media. And I will give you the recipe. Okay, now, let's go to the next section now, guys. Um, what am I going to do it? Okay, let's put this one side. Right. Let's go to number two. The other section of this one. You so guys need to see what's going on. You know. Let's remove the porridge. Porridge, we're done with you. We're not gonna keep you any longer. All right, we're not gonna keep the porridge any longer. All right, everything is happening in the kitchen. Here it is. If you don't get your copy, go and get your copy. It is important. All right, a lot of people say, Chef Ricardo, 
what's so special about this book now this book is a very very special book i did it from my heart for you guys oh, well. okay so if you don't get a copy of the book it is on amazon limited order at the moment guys when this book go it's gonna go all right go to amazon and get your copy all right now the book said chef ricardo's secret recipe to success now you need to go over to amazon and get your copy all right trust me a lot of people are supporting me so far but still there's a lot of people doesn't even know about the book and that chef ricardo did this um journey book this is a book about my journey and this book is important for you to get it and to show your kids if you have kids i don't know or if you have no it's a book which is generation to generation this book it's gonna be a very important thing or someone can come from somewhere and get to this level it is a very powerful book and the only message to you today if you are hearing the voice of chef ricardo give yourself a copy it worth it it's not all about money it's not all about nothing it's all about what inside of this book which someone can learn from chef ricardo uh, you can tell someone you can tell your kids you can tell us and listen here another jamaican come from somewhere and do something and it happened this is the story you need to read short and spicy very short and spicy right to the point i never tell anyone about my journey and i decide to do it all right so go and get yourself a copy of this book it is on amazon you know what i mean take a picture of the book go over to amazon do your pre-order and you will get your book you can get it on king do the book will be releasing on the 13th of may 2020 that's the next month okay 2024 we have 125 recipe book coming out with all of my healthy recipes detoxing weight loss and all sorts of stuff gonna be in that one this book is to for you to give your kids to tell them listen here is someone who coming from nothing being into something okay powerful book i can't tell you much about it you have to see it for yourself okay you have to see it for yourself and get yourself a copy follow me on instagram and i can give you the link is in the description box you can go in the description box and get the link for you to pre-order your copy okay pre-order it it's worth it all right thank you so much jennifer big up yourself Thank you so much. Great. Good morning, Chef Ricardo. Great to see you and join the morning. Thank you so much. Zero eight. Big up yourself. All right. Eat Good TV. I am getting it for my birthday. When is your birthday, Eat Good TV? Don't tell me that me and your father on the same month, you know. <laughs> I am promote. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. Promote it on your Instagram page for me. Put it on your Instagram page. Um, put it on your Facebook page. You know what I mean? If Guys, if you're proud of your own, you know what I mean? This is something I'm telling you. You need to get this book. It is a very powerful. <laughs> Eat good TV. Be careful, you know. Sharon Bentley. <laughs> Big up yourself. Thank you so much for, for coming on the show. Um, Eat good TV. Be careful. <laughs> Eat good TV. You're cracking me up in the morning, you know. Um, big up my TikTok audience and uh, also my Facebook audience. Uh, I am breaking my uh, okay. I am baking the best Christmas cake because of your YouTube channel video. Wow, the queen is saying that she baked the best Christmas cake because of me. Big up yourself, the queen. Thank you so much for that support. I really appreciate it. Um, Craig, why are you just coming on, man? Are you cooking? You're late. Support the book coming in. Big up yourself, Craig, man. Craig is already getting his harder. Harder is copy already. Thank you so much. But guys, as I said, it worth it, man. If you believe in, you know what I mean, another person can come from something to nothing, from nothing to something and have a life story to share. A lot of people got life story to share, but, you know what I mean, it doesn't share. I'll share my one with you guys. That means you guys can see something different. All right? Today's weekend. And whatever you guys do, I'm doing a lot of talking, but I want to say, I want to take the time out to say thank every one of you guys who support Chef Ricardo cooking journey all over the years. I really appreciate it. And the greatest thing, the 
the greatest thing you could ever, ever, ever hear is this. Remember this. God loves you and Chef Ricardo loves you. All right? So, look after yourself. Have a fantastic weekend. Stay blessed. And whatever you guys do, remember to pray for one of my subscribers. Just went through a strokes and pray for her that the Lord would bless her and heal her and protect her. All right? Um, what the book time, chef? Um, what the book time? The book is on the 13th of May, 2020, 2023. And then on the 27th is a bigger one. Okay? There's a lot of stuff going on with the book. This book is supposed to see it many places because why? It's a very positive book and it's also a very good book. All right. Chef, I want what I'm waiting for the book. Okay, nice one. So here it is. You can get it on King Do pre-order. May the 13th is releasing. King Do. May the 27th, hardcover and soft cover. It is going to be an, an amazing book for many people. All right. Yes, Eat Good TV, pray for one of our subscribers who just went through a strokes. And guys, I'm telling you, you know what I mean? Look after your health. I'm always saying this. Look after your health. Look after yourself. Eat good. Cut out rice and pasta sometimes. You can eat it, but be careful. Don't eat too much of these things. Um, drinking a lot of natural drinks and water, very important. Um, most of these teas where you see I've been doing, I just come from the supermarket, and these are things we shall buy. Just to give you a heads up. Just come from Alan the Health Supermarket. You know why? I go on to buy these things. Very important. All right. Extra virgin olive oil and it's organic. All right. So these things are things which I try not to run out of. It is important. So these things present your sugar level from go up and cut down your cholesterol level. And information. You need to slow down all of those things in your immune system. All right, but it's another time on that topic, guys. We're talking about the book. Get yourself a copy, and thank you so much for the support. If you already order, big up yourself, and my respect goes for you a million percent. And remember, God loves you, and God will take care of you. Just put your trust in Him, and I'll see.